is the double treble crochet, known as the triple treble in UK terminology. To begin, we need to make a foundation chain. I've made a sample chain of four. We need to bring our yarn up to the height of the next stitch. For a double treble, we chain five. To chain, we yarn over and pull it through the loop. This chain of five counts as our first double treble stitch. The sixth chain from the hook is the final stitch from the previous row. So we want to put our next double treble into the seventh stitch along. We yarn over our hook three times so that we have four loops on the hook. We insert our hook into the seventh stitch along, yarn over and pull for a loop. We now have five stitches on our hook. Yarn over, pull through two loops. We have four loops. Yarn over, pull through two. We have three loops. Yarn over, pull through two loops. We have two loops. Yarn over and pull through two loops. And that's our first double treble crochet. On to the next stitch along. We yarn over three times. Four loops on the hook. Insert our hook into the stitch. Yarn over and pull up a loop. Five loops on the hook. Yarn over, pull through two. Four loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Three loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Two loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Onto the next stitch, yarn over three times. We have four loops on our hook. Insert our hook into the stitch. Yarn over and pull it through. We have five loops on our hook. Yarn over and pull through two. Four loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Three loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Two loops. Yarn over, pull through two. And our first row is complete. To bring our work up to the height of the next row, we need to make a chain of five. And we turn our work. That chain of five counts as our first double treble stitch. So we want to put our next stitch into the second stitch along. From the top, you can see these Vs. And from the side, you can see the gaps between the stitches. This is where we place our stitch. Yarn over three times so we have four loops on the hook. We insert our hook into the stitch. Yarn over and pull it through. Five loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Four loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Three loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Two loops. Yarn over and pull through two. Onto the next stitch. Yarn over three times. Four loops. Insert our hook into the stitch. Yarn over and pull it through. Five loops. Yarn over and pull through two. Four loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Three loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Two loops. Yarn over, pull through two. The final stitch in the row goes into the top of the chain five from the previous row. Yarn over three times. Insert our hook into the stitch. Yarn over and pull it through. Yarn over, pull through two. 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 Our second row is complete. We carry on in the same way, starting each row with a chain of five. That chain of five counting as our first stitch. Into each of the next stitches along, we put in our double treble crochet by yarning over three times, inserting our hook into the stitch and pulling up a loop. We then yarn over and pull through two loops four times. We put the final stitch of each row into the top of the chain five from the previous row. Don't forget this step unless you want your work to come out wonky. And there we have our double treble crochet, known as the triple treble in UK terminology.